Hello, how are you? Well, I've just checked into my hotel room and this is where I'm going to be calling home for the next week. So, okay, um, I've only got my iPhone at the moment, so I'm just going to let modern technology dictate how I get my information over to you. And I'm actually going to take the path of least resistance because oh, it has been so busy and I've had so much on and I'm already exhausted and I haven't even started. So I'm going to get the information to you. I'd love to have you on board this journey because it's pretty exciting. So what happened? Okay, so basically, as you may be aware, that um, we've had some severe flooding up in uh, Queensland, and so the tour leaders of this particular tour company uh, have been affected by that. And so we got a phone call saying, uh, yes, hello, um, would you and Pat like to help out in this situation whereby we uh, need someone to fulfil the place of these particular couple? And Pat and I are both experienced in um, what we do, particularly in the Tour de France. Um, and this is probably a little bit easier because everyone speaks English. And we, well, I lived in Adelaide for six years and Pat's from here. So it's our backyard, so it's kind of nice. So anyway, we're like, sure, so here we are. Uh, today I actually did a demo. I am um, also a thermos mix instructor which is another hat that I wear, and it was a 1950s theme, hence the, the beads and the check shirt and the hair, and I did have it flicked out early. It's kind of gone a bit flat now, but yeah, so that was massive, and I that was like out in the Barossa Valley area and uh, back in Adelaide now. I have a meeting in about an hour's time to just find out information about the guests. They start arriving tomorrow, so have to find all of that out, what's going on. Um, we are staying in the Hilton, which is where um, like the riders are staying. And actually, I shared a lift with legendary voice of cycling, and that's Mr. Phil Liggett. His accent is so unmistakably his. And I'm like, I know that voice. And he's like, oh, do you? And I said, oh, Phil? And he's like, yes. So I was like, oh, hello. So I was like really excited and shook his hand and kind of said, yeah, nice to meet you. And away I went. So, yeah, it's pretty exciting. Some very fit boys getting around. And, yeah, and actually I'm going to get up and show you because we can actually see the, the village. Uh, I think they call it the athletes. I don't know what it is, but it's just down here. And I'm going to do a uh, 360 and you can check it out. So let's have a look. So this is the view from our window. Let's check it out. If you can see, there we are. So... Pretty fabulous, hey? Oh, a bit dark there. Ooh. Uh, yeah, so that's it. So, you know, oh, you're down here, aren't you? So that's, you know, this is, you know, what I said about trailing Grace. You know, my friends go, eh, Grace, we can't keep up with you. Because this kind of stuff is not unusual for me. Like, one minute I'm coming over to Adelaide to do a bunch of Thermomix demos. And next thing I know, I've got a tour guide hat on and going to be driving people here and there and making sure that, you know, the vegetarians are taken care of and people who ordered a, a double aren't in a twin room and all those sorts of things and giving them a great time while they're here. So oh, I'm exhausted just telling you about it. So that's it for now. Keep, uh, keep in tune, keep in touch, follow me, what's going on, and hopefully we'll show you a bit of the tour down under as well. It's a very exciting time. So we'll see you again soon. Bye.